Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, The MK Lady. Well, I have a huge video for you. Now I say that every video, but I have five bags right here, two bags right here, and a bunch of things to talk to you about. And today is actually, it's going to be a surprise unboxing. Now, I usually do my unboxing videos on Friday night at seven o'clock, but I decided that I am going to do this unboxing video right now in the afternoon video. So it is a coach, yes, you guessed it. And so that'll be at the end of the video and I'll explain why in a minute. Now, I wanted to show you something. It is snowing, snowing, snowing in my province. It is winter wonderland and it's spring, but <laughs> I don't know, we're getting snowfall here and it's supposed to be cloudy and snowy all weekend. So we'll see how that goes for the weekend. I do also want to talk to you I was requested by one of my subscribers, Damien. He wanted to take a look at the Michael Kors Mini Hamilton because he wants to buy one for his wife. So he wanted me to do a review. Now I'll go ahead and get started. It is not very big. It is small. It is tiny. It has a crossbody strap and I'll show you in a minute but it is probably about I would say seven or eight inches across and about five inches high and about three inches in depth so it is not very big at all so you can fit a coach wristlet from the outlet you can fit your phone now there is a slip pocket inside but obviously a phone wouldn't fit and this is no case regular iPhone so it won't fit so I have to slip it in the center of the purse now it does fit a full-size wallet but you kind of have to like put it at an angle and then put it in there is a back slip pocket there's no outside slip pockets as you could tell because it's super tiny but there is this beautiful lock details so the straps are adjustable and detachable so I do have it on the middle setting as you could see right there so I'm five five and a half medium build and as a crossbody now this is on the middle setting so it it is you know hits to my hip and I could probably lower it or make it shorter or longer if I needed to but I think this chain detail really adds to it you can't really put it at the crook of your arm because it kind of stops at your forearm so it's just mainly handheld crossbody or a shoulder just like that so that is for Damien I'm sure if you buy it for her she is going to love it it's a beautiful beautiful cute little bag so now I'm gonna take my stuff out of here because I'm gonna tell you about the outfit of the day. And I'll put this little mini Hamilton right there. So make sure it doesn't topple over there. Now the outfit of the day. So Hilberg and Burke earrings, as you can see right there. Now I have this cute, remember when statement necklaces were kind of the in thing? Well, this is a Leah Sophia necklace that I got a few years ago and I thought I'd bring it out for the video. I wanted to tell you about my beautiful love bracelet that I got from my friend Crystal and then the Michael Kors watch in bronze and rose gold and this one is from the Calgary Cross Iron Mills outfit, outfit, outlet. <laughs> so just a regular plain rose gold ring from, I believe this is from Ricky's, no, Reitman's, sorry. So it's gonna be an all neutral day. I just have a little cardigan on and then a little silk top as well as 
black pants. So we're going to look at all my neutrals and we are actually going to start with my newest neutral which is the rain satchel in the color bisque now it's coming off a little bit of a yellow type of tone but it's super pretty there's no back pocket i still see these on the michael kors outlet and the promo 30 off is still working it's quite a roomy size bag and you can fit quite a few things in here like your wallet and your makeup bag and my phone is at the bottom my dogs are barking there might be somebody at the door it does have some slip pockets as you could see right here and it is a medium sized bag so you could wear it on your shoulder just like that or like that and then if you'd like you could wear it on the crook of your arm it wouldn't be too big for crossbody because it's super big so the next color I wanted to show you and we've seen these color these styles of bag this is my favorite style of bag is the Salma and truffle and as you could see right there it is not as big, not as tall, and not as bulky. So it does have a little bit more of a grayer effect than the best color Michael Kors. And then we are going to get into another Salma, which is the dark khaki. He had this color a few years ago. And... This one is actually from the outlet because it doesn't have any back buttons like this one. It's a little different inside, a little different on top, but they're almost basically the same. It doesn't have the buttons right here like it does on here, but this is the truffle and this is the dark khaki. So the next bag I wanted to show you this beauty now this is the dark dune and this is the Carson and pebbled leather it is so pretty there's no back pocket it kind of looks like the rain satchel but it's more rounded and it's in pebbled leather so as you can see from the bisque to the dark dune which is a darker color and then the dark khaki this one gives more of a gray this one gives more of a yellow and then you can even throw in the truffle and this color is the bisque so lightest to darkest so bisque truffle dark dune or sorry dark khaki and dark dune so there they are right there so that leads me to my last bag that I showed just the other day. So I'm not keeping this down anymore when I'm storing it because I noticed there started to get some indents here. So for the Coach Ellie, I'm not going to keep it down stored like that. I'm going to keep it up and just keep it on top, but I'm not going to slam it down like I usually do. So the stone color in the coach reminds me of and is super similar to the truffle color so this one has the rivets and the black on the side but as you could see it is a beautiful color it's almost so similar so actually let's just get into this and then i can take i can show you there is still the dry packs and then lots of zip pockets, or sorry, slip pockets and areas to put your items. And I like how this kind of connects here, but I just want to show you, this is the smallest out of the neutral bags. So it is the smallest and it can be shoulder, crossbody, and handheld if you'd like right there, but on the shoulder, whoops in there I just dropped it I never meant to drop it and then I think it's more of 
you know a crossbody and it kind of matches with some of the grays in my top right here my nail is snagging and it keeps bugging me and it's just with all the hand sanitizers and everything and constantly washing them my nails have really taken a beating so that is the beautiful ellie in stone and oh my goodness it is still snowing so much so so much so now we can get into the unboxing now the reason why this is a different unboxing is that i did a trade with my good friend colleen hi colleen and this was about a little over a month or so ago and i decided to trade her one of my whitney's and i got this beauty of a bay and it is the coach like i said before it is the coach in the stone and it has all these embellishments and details on it it is so pretty so girly so ladylike and i'm just getting a phone call but i have to hang up on that and i absolutely love it so there's no wrap because she did use it a couple times she said it's very structured and on the inside is the oxblood it does have the brass hardware and then this white i think the cost contrasting colors of the white and the black and then the stone like look how cute this is so this could be worn as a shoulder just like that or you can put it as a long shoulder just like that and it looks cute super super cute like that with the hang tag and the bottom is the two tone so it does have the black here and then the stone the back is the stone so that is super super pretty now you're probably wondering why would she get another stone similar type purse but these are both different this one has the embellishments and the kind of stud detailing right here and then this one has the gold rivet so i do think that they are different and they actually they actually um are very pretty and similar so let me just grab my stuff and then you can take a good look at the inside of the bag and she did say she left me i didn't see these on the website i think they did sell out she said she got it at the website so the item number seven four zero nine zero and it's the scallop rivet parker in the stone blue malty so that is it right there now it's pretty similar to all the parkers that are shoulders so let's just grab my items and i keep getting text messages and phone calls so a large size makeup bag can fit in there and michael kors wallet can fit comfortably in there as you could see right here and then the makeup bag and let's see how much time do we have so even a coach wristlet can fit in there so that's all going in there and let's see if my ray-ban sunglasses can fit in there i'm sure they can because it it is a lot bigger and there is more room as you can see the expansion right here and then i'll grab my i will grab my measuring tape so that all fits oh and we forgot the cell phone so let's grab the cell phone this is a regular size cell phone and yes that fits perfectly i even think it would fit a case so let me just grab my measuring tape and then i can show you what the dimensions are oopsie there goes my mini hamilton let's just put that on this side i knew that was gonna happen it wasn't stabilized on there so let's just measure this across is 10 that's a really nice size the depth is four and top to bottom is 
seven. So it is so super cute. I think it's just adorable. And it is different and it is wider in dimension here. So this one can fit way more than this one. So that is my surprise unboxing for you. I just absolutely love it. I can't wait to use it. It's going to be a while before. Well, hopefully not. Things are going to change. I know they're going to change. And stay tuned for Monday's unboxing. There's not an unboxing tonight. So actually Sunday for Mother's Day, I'm going to do the unboxing. So stay tuned for Sunday's video because this is today's unboxing, the Parker shoulder and the tri-color it's so so pretty please give this video a thumbs up because you know it helps in the youtube ratings and it helps my channel helps me stay alive and relevant in the youtube world thank you for watching please subscribe to my channel the mk lady also don't forget to hit the notification bell because every time i upload a video you will get notified have a great day bye